Hello, Red Hawks. This is Mr. Laversky. One of the things we need your help with is in having more kids with the Google Doc open that gives the listing of buses for our PM bus arrival. So we realize that a couple of kids are that some kids aren't sure of how to add things to their Google Drive or how to find them once they uh, to find those things once they get something via email. So um, pretty soon I'm going to share that document with you again. Uh, and you'll get an email, and the email may look something like this. Mrs. Lidman shared this with me. It says WMS PM bus arrival 2. This is one that I made that's a copy. It's not the real document. So I click on that, and I open it. It says here, what do I want to do? She's invited me to view this document. I can't edit it. So I click on that document, and it looks like this. So I can make a, do a couple things at this point. I can, first of all, I can click on view only. But what I can do is star it. That will make sure that I can find it a little easier. But the most important thing you need, need to do is click on this Add to My Drive. And you click on Add to My Drive, and you can organize and put it in a folder if you want. But in general, just Add to My Drive. So that document is there, and you'll find that it'll populate uh, as we have our bus duty, so you know where each bus is. So how do I find it then? So I go to my Google Drive later, and I type in PM Bus. And you'll see uh, here's the PM bus arrival too. I click on that and it's going to open up. And again, so there it was in my Google Drive. I started. I also, uh, if you want to, you can click on uh, the star up here and click on add to uh, a bookmark if you want to do that. But you don't have to do that. Um, but you always want to click on that add to drive and then star it. So a couple of other ways you can find it is you can go to shared with me. And if I share it with you or Mrs. Lidman, if I share it with you, well, let's say it's Mrs. Lidman who shared it with you, then I can find things that she shared with me. There's the PM bus arrival too, so you could type in one of our email addresses. You could also click on things that are starred. And I don't have many things that are starred, but here's our PM bus arrival. So that star is a good thing to be able to do to find things very quickly. Then when you guys download Google Drive onto your phones, log in using your D303 uh, login, your 800 number. Log in, and then you should be able to find things pretty quickly, just like I've shown you here. If you have questions, stop in the library, and they can help you and show you how to access that document as well. All righty. So... The other thing you can do is find Google Docs on your phone and Google Drive on your phone, and here's what you need to do. The first thing you have to do is you have to make sure that you have Google Drive on your phone. Now, I have an iPhone, so what I would do is swipe down and type in the word Drive, and it says Google Drive, so I know I have that. The other thing I want to make sure that I have is Docs. So I open Google Docs, and I have Google Docs right there. So make sure before you do anything you have those two things on your phone. So I'm going to go back to my Google Drive, and I am going to search for the doc in Google Drive. I click up in the little micro, uh, little um, magnifying glass up here. I click on that, and I'll show you what to do. The first thing you do, if you have two accounts, please make sure that the one uh, that when you click on the little um, three lines over here, the little cog, that it says your name down there. Because if you have a personal account, it'll be a little weird. So I click on that, and I'm going to type in. Um, it'll ask me if I want to do file types, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. I'm going to click on search, and I'm going to type in PM bus. And it's going to search for it, search for it, search for it, and there's my bus arrival doc. So I'm going to click on that, and that doc is going to open. And you're going to see this is for yesterday, but it's blank. So it gets to be 2, 325, 330, and all of a sudden you're going to see buses start to populate on there. So you see bus 24 is here, bus 14 is here. Bus 17 is here, uh, gosh, 22 is showing up, uh, 13 is here, et cetera, et cetera. But this is where you look at all those things. Now, if you don't have Drive installed, this, or excuse me, Google Docs installed, this gets a little tricky. So make sure you have Google Docs installed. So uh, it's very simple. You could, your parents can look at this and see when buses come and, and go, but this will give you an idea of how to use the app on your phone and make sure that you can see this at any point. But also remember that we do put buses on the whiteboard, on the whiteboard in um, just outside a couple of doors. All right, that should hopefully help you. Thanks.